You are now listening to 15 Minutes of Fame Radio. Let's go! Guy, guy. 15 Minutes of Fame. This is fun right here. Again, <laughs> Ben Swayze, <laughs> New Era Podcast. Uh, France, Let's Talk Battle Rap. And Tony Bro, the best judge from Ultimate Madness 1 wow. and 2. Uh, the only two-time judge. Black like Compass. The only two-time judge. Two-time judge. Yo, appreciate it, man. Shout totally to impressed with your judging skills, my brother. I really Whether you were right or wrong, yeah. I like the way you You was wrong you a couple times, there, but it's so. okay. okay. I'll hold that. It's, a few it's like battle it. rap. Okay. There's nobody in battle rap that is always 100% right on oh, any. Well, Ron, you yeah. was wrong on every single battle. So oh. Good. Chill out. Good. Well, see, Uncle, Uncle, Uncle's going to wear that. He doesn't care. Are we giving you 25,000 worth of interviews? Facts. <laughs> <laughs> these, these are very, 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 did I say very? Yeah. yeah. Very good conversations we're having and Uncle debates. Garage. This shit yeah. is just fire, man. Like, Thank I like you. watching shit like this, so. Appreciate uh, well, they Appreciate don't you. know. We've already done them. Those are the other joints. This, <laughs> right, right, this, right, right, right. this topic we're going to talk about is the uh, CPR. Oh, yeah, yeah, this is crazy. Yeah, so... France, you alone, or was it you and Let's Talk Battle Rap? Did y'all have a conversation and come up with this concept? Talk to me about that, where the whole thing came from. Shout out to the whole team. Real quick. Shout out to the whole team. Shout out to Vlad, CC, Tim, and Dylan. Yeah, we all, and Titus, our update specialist, he, we all created uh, CPR together as a whole. We kind of were like just counting chokes. We thought to ourselves like, yo, you know, what can you quantify in battle rap, right? And you can ask the question, how many chokes does X rapper has? Mm -hmm. And there's an accurate answer to it. So we're like, it's public information, and it's a real percentage to see how much of their rounds they're completing. You can get real intricate. They count the stumbles, count the amount of chokes, uh, how many times they choke per round in a battle. We didn't want to complicate it. So it was like chokes, percentage, ratio, chokes, powder ratio, CPR. Oh, CPR. And then it just all oh, was one big funny entendre. Mm -hmm. And I think it, held, it holds battle rappers accountable, and it really puts careers into perspective because you start to see certain guys that are choking 25 to 30 percent or 40 percent of their career and it's like right. damn like i didn't realize you were choking that frequently mm. you know what i mean can i can i ask you a question about yeah, that yeah. media oh, media. oh you guys won't i just didn't want to forget something sure. so when you say choke right oh. like there are so many different ways that people look at what a choke is Facts. what a stumble is Facts. like when you say choke what is that so i i consider specifically a, yeah, if you yeah, can yeah. get yeah. I consider that a wasn't your question, was it, Tom? No, no, no. That was okay, good. cool. No, no, I'm sorry. That was, that was a better good question. question. That was good. Yeah, that's a good yeah. question because it's, it's, <laughs> yeah. it's, it's a little gray line between. In my opinion, a stumble is when you lose lyrical composure and you mm. keep on continuing the material. Mm. A choke is when the material comes to an abrupt stop. And what's is there a time frame that you say like he choked and he recovered in three seconds, twenty seconds, seconds five right? Seconds. Like, no, nah, because losing your composure, like you get off balance, but you're still standing. Mm. So like. That's why a stumble is like a stumble. Like, oh, you didn't completely fall. A choke is when you completely fell. Right. You know, you can't get up from the fall, but we're not going to forget the fact that you fell. Okay. Mm -hmm. E.I. Emerson Kennedy versus Prep. Um, Emerson Kennedy didn't just give up. It was stumbles. Like, but he stopped at one point. He stopped at one point for a second. He tried to get his shit back together. And he started rapping again. Mm -hmm. I think that a choke is... When you, you just don't remember that next bar. Not stumbling over... Correct me if I'm wrong, y'all. If you're stumbling over some words, it's like... I could talk right now. I've been drinking. I've been like, yo... For, for the, 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 my bad. Fritz. And it's like, I know your name. But, right. but I just stumbled over your... I stumbled How about this? If you're delivering a point, but you stumble over it, you're stumbling. But if you like come to a halt of your of your point... And you forgot and like, what the point was. Uh, damn, I wasn't going to say anything. But they call that yeah. a brain freeze. That happens. When you're having yeah. a conversation. Yeah, that happens. Yeah, 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 that can yeah, definitely yeah. happen. Yeah. But it's, 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 uh, it's something you can quantify in battle rap. Something that you can count. And I think it matters. And, the and thing that I don't like, though, with you, Fritz, and I don't mean to cut you off, bro, is like... <laughs> you know what I don't like about you, dog? No. <laughs> he got right to it. We've been waiting to take him to court on this. Go ahead. No. Oh, okay. So that's where... Okay. okay. So what's going Yo, on. I just wanted to clear that. Yeah, he had a question, too, though. I, I, I forget but, but, you, but, but it's okay. The thing that I don't like about Fritz is that... <laughs> Fritz is the most knowledgeable person that I've ever met in battle rap. Don't patronize me. He'd probably whoop your ass on a bar exam, I would I would guess. I would guess. I would guess he'd probably whoop your ass in a bar exam. Yeah, probably not. <laughs> Fritz is the most, and I'm, I'm telling you, I've been around a lot of people in battle rap. 
Francis is the most knowledgeable person I've ever been around my battle rap, and like, appreciate that. You also know, so you're aware of what you put out. You know the consequences that come with it. Yeah. Like I know what I know when I fucking say some shit. There's probably five or six battle rappers that want to beat my you ass. Feel the way. When you put it out, it's like, yeah, I put it out. But guess what? A week ago, I put out some good shit about you. So it's like, you gotta take the good with the bad. Mm -hmm. Like. You know what you're putting out, France. You know the content that you're putting out. Which is it's good because yes, they have to be accountable for, accountable for it, but sometimes you gotta put that you gotta just know what you're doing, bro. You know what you're doing, France. Alright, so I'll give you I'll give you a really interesting one. Uh, interesting CPR. Uh -huh. Shotgun Shook who choked against Jada Nightwing. That was his eleventh his eleventh choke in Shut Jersey. Shook. We in Jersey too, so Shook hit no, the phone. No, but this, but, but he he, he, he holds himself very well shook accountable. Too, I, 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 shook fit in the Shook. Man. Yeah, shout, shout out to Slim Shook. He holds himself accountable, so he held it in pretty good stride. You know, I think so. Hmm. This is this was his eleventh choke in thirty four battles. Okay, so he's choked thirty percent of his career. But right. check this out. Right. Six out of those eleven came in twenty nineteen. So now you have a landscape of his career to say, oh, this is where something went wrong or something's not clicking. You know what I'm saying? Jada Nightwing choked in two out of five battles before the tournament. And it, so that, that, that's, a, that's a high ratio. Never, Never choked, choked again, again and decreased the CPR. See, so people, now, don't th people don't think about it that way, too. Mm -hmm. So you're showing both stats of where they improved and where they got Absolutely. worse. Absolutely. When there's significant right, so improvements. But, but let me ask you this. Did you do the statistics on how many of those chokes people care about? How would I be able to know that? You don't. So that's why travelers <laughs> are upset. That's why they hate you. You know why? I, I make because I guarantee four of them chokes from Chug. I don't care about. I, but I, I made it. I made. I, I attached to I a lead. I promise you. Yeah, yeah. I have. I don't care. And Chug probably knows that. Right. That's why they don't like that. I attach it to a league, so that way it's like these are your career sure. CPR stats for URL. I don't know what it is in the, in the grand scheme of things. It could be worse. It could be better. But I attach it to a league for that, that specific reason. Yeah. So like that way you know what's your performance like on this league, good or bad. Okay. My only my only thing was in the same vein as uh as Ben is that you gotta because in media you gotta know when there's gonna be certain backlash. Cause yeah. like battlers would be like, well, yeah, I choked in the battle. But it's like it's two million views and but people they, retweet everything from they it. They need this. Though. I got a they shirt with though. lines Prince, from the battle with merch Prince, on. You do a good job. What bro. are you talking they need about? This. I mean, I, I count. I count people's That's headliners. I count people's yeah. platinum battles. I right, count when they right. hit a lot of little accolades and strides in their careers because those things are noticeable. They they, they it matter to these battle rappers. It should be acknowledged. Sure. In the stat sheet for any sport, there's a turnover and a plus and minus. Sure. You can't you can't talk about how many points without the turnover sometimes. But you know the you know the problem is in your defense too, because I do like what you you're doing overall. Right. I, I just think that people ask cherry that pick. question. It sound like y'all don't. No, like no, no. I, I do. I like it, but I do have to. I hate this, it. I, I fucking hate that. I shit. like it, but I have to address the because the, the, Prince why knows people what he's would doing. not like it because they don't. Prince is not dumb. He's not a dumb person. I don't care. Hold on, let me move my phone away. Okay. Prince is not dumb. Yeah. All right. That too. He, he's probably one of the most smartest people nah, in battle rap. Don't do that. Meaning that don't when I say that, I don't just say like, he's oh, patronizing me. he went to school or something <laughs> like that. Prince knows that when he puts certain things out, he knows that it's gonna people are gonna see that. He can do that for anybody. Yeah. He can do that for any battle rapper in the fucking world. Mm -hmm. He I only do it when they increase it. So if they choke recently, they have increased their career CPR, updating so what's what it's at currently. I'm not gonna give out I'm not gonna give out a database of everybody that has it. I well, have yeah. it, but I'm not gonna give it out. Your your method isn't to bash battlers only right. when they don't do Never. well. You update it when they had a clean this victory this, in a this, class. This isn't even a Prince is needed. I mean, Prince is needed. Yeah. Love it or hate it, Prince is needed. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I hate yeah. it at times yeah. because I know like your friends. Yeah. You know that this is I gonna. Mean, you want to hear a cool CPR? DNA CPR is under three percent, and he has one hundred and fifty-one battles. That's insane. It's crazy. Damn. It's crazy. That. So then, people only see it in one light. They don't see it so in the other side. How how how? So how many battles does that mean he choked in? It's three percent on one fifty, man. Uh, that means once every. Well, I said less than three percent. So that means oh, once every sixty ba fifty battles, or once every you know, my bad, once every thirty battles. He's choked once in less than four. He's choked in less than four battles of his career in one hundred and fifty one battles. Once every thirty five battles, something like that. That's actually crazy. That's crazy. 
So it, I see why DNA. Hold on, hold on. Oh, real quick, real quick. Guys, I guys, guys. There's one that was really critical. Uh, South to Surf. Unfortunately, she has me blocked. Surf, we're big fans of yours. We make history. We put out your good stats. Because check this out. Here's a really crazy stat. Before Gnome X and the Lord of Lux battle, sure. Sue Surf has the most Gnome headliners in history at four. Wow. Wow. So he's headlined, he's headlined the most gnomes in URL history. Wow. Rock, but, wait, wait, hold on. Rock did Gnome 1. He did gnome no shit. He did, did he headline? Did he headline? Did he headline? Oh, oh headline. shit, my bad. Yeah. So he has the most gnome headliners in history. This is the shit here, I go through. Here, and who here. has the most Summer Madness headlines? I think Rex. it's. Damn, I forgot who it was just now. I think it's either Hollow or, yeah, maybe or, Hollow. or Eclipse. I'm not the. So it's Hollow back in the, or in Eclipse? The, yeah, I'm, I'll drive back <laughs> in a second. Good but, 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 um. No. Shit, you got to me off for a second. I'm sorry. Um, Tay Rock. Surf. Surf. Four times no. He's choked in three out of those four. From two, from December, wait, 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 wait. December uh, 2015 till June 2019, the Aver battle on Guerrilla Warzone, till Geechee Gotti's battle and Gnome 9. Uh -huh. Three and a half battle. years. He's, he's choked in every individual yeah. battle he's had. So that's Damn. three and a half years of choking. Damn. That's, and that's what about Rum Nitty? Choke. That's not in there? No, he, choked he, choked. Him, he choked against Rome. I didn't hear you say Rome, yeah. did he? So. Yeah. She said that within those uh, like Aver, three or four years. Aver, T Top, Rum Nitty. Uh, Rex was in between that as well. Sugar was in between that as well. Yeah. That's, hey, kind, man, of, that's kind of like, damn, son. Like, sure. so, so talk to me about the backlash that you got from the CPR. It was strange because yeah, talk about it. <laughs> look at y'all, motherfuckers. Yeah, talk about yeah, backlash. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, two, people, two people were really critical of it. Mike P and Franchise, and shouts to both those guys. They've both been on the show. Um, big supporter of both. I fuck with both of them. Heavy. Um, they, whether they like the stat or not, it's nothing personal. Mike right. P said it makes a mockery of battle rap. And I disagree because... Mockery. Like, That's I disagree awesome. because it's public information. Like, anybody can go on the internet and see it. And Franchise was like, why Sorry, would you... I couldn't quite hear you. Franchise was like, why would you count these things nothing else? And I'm like, Franchise, like, you're a battle rapper? And maybe Mike too. You guys can't sustain nine chokes in your career and probably have a career. Mm. This should make you should see this and just think to yourself like, damn, the playing field is really different. Because if Mike P, Mike P choked once and look what happened—the criticism against against a Bill Collector. He choked against JC Two, but whatever. Like he didn't get criticized for it. Mm -hmm. But I'm saying he can't choke nine times, eleven times, eight times, thirty percent, forty percent of his career, and probably still have a sustainable career. In fact, franchise lost the judge battle to somebody that might have almost choked. Against mm. Tink, mm. you know, choke. Tink looked really rusty. Got through it. Boom. Yeah, that was crazy. So you do the CPR, right? I well, you mentioned Gnome, like you knew, you know, accolades from the battle rappers from Gnome. Like, is the CPR the only thing you do stat wise? Ah, of course okay. not. Well, tell people that because it, it it makes it seem <laughs> like, especially this guy, makes it seem like you only do negative shit. Yeah, no. Nah, so. He does. <laughs> <laughs> That's what gets the most press. It's unfortunate. Positive yeah. media does not get press. That's just what happens. When y'all battlers get mad, it, people click on it more. I don't know why that is. When we big y'all up, people don't seem to like it as much. I don't know why. This but maybe if yeah. you guys retweet or talk about the dope analysis that you got when you heard, let's talk battle rap. Yo. And he was like, damn, yo, they really broke that round down to a T. And expressed exactly what I Every thought. Every battler I does know what to let's talk so, about And that's right. crazy that until they did the CPR is, shit, that they wasn't even but, on a lot of y'all radar. And that's crazy. I mean, I've been on the show. I'll give you a bunch of I'll give, you, I'll give you a bunch of cool ones. Like we we do stuff what like happened? who has the I'd highest G battle on the league? Who has five out of the top ten highest G battle on the league? There's a little club I made, like five out of top ten. Who sure. dominates leagues? Hitman, yeah. Arsenal, 40 Bars, Disaster. Oh, those are the only four battle rappers that have five out of the highest top ten view battles on any league. That is crazy. I think Clips as well. That is crazy. That's, a, that's a really small elite club to be a part of. Mm. Headliners count. You know, I, I have a really cool one about Chess last year that uh, he headlined Born Legacy 6. He was, I think, 21. He was the youngest battle rapper to headline a card outside of New York mm. since Calico. Mm. With... Uh, Motor City Mayhem. Mm. So it's like, shit, like that. That's an accolade, bringing an event outside of New York and being the guy for it. It hasn't been done since 2011. Mm. My favorite, 
accolade of all time. Here, my favorite accolade. Why are we going over this guy's accolade? <laughs> nah. You know that you. No, 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 not mine, not mine, not mine. But this, hey, is, this is my favorite. I'm impressed. Nah, like talk, 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 friend. Talk, talk, friend. Don't hate Ben. Don't hate Ben. I do it all day with him. You see him? Because I do it all day with him. Nah, they don't. They don't. They don't. Let him talk. Let him go. The 36 people that's gonna watch this interview. All 36 of y'all got some great stats. Right, yo. Exactly. My favorite of all time. Is, is Charlie Clips' run. Because I feel like Clips has drawn to the stigma of like, oh, he doesn't take battle serious. And he's, always, he's always phoning it in. But Charlie Clips headlined Gnome and Summer Madness in the same year. Okay. Twice, bro. It's never Only been done before. Only battle rapper to do it. 2014 and 2015. Only battle rapper to do it. So that means you would have... So he headlined... Gnome 4. Gnome 4. Summer Gnome Madness 4, 4 against Rex. Mm -hmm. No five against Hollow, Summer Man is five against Lux. That's four in a row. Of that's Clips a eight. crazy fucking that's stat. That's why Clips was like a That shows you what his team. run was like. His The Clips run is... Clips run is insane. different. He's, he's Clips, is different. He's as one far of as favorites runs, when he's on his shit. It's Clips, and then E.T. is next. He's, nice. he's getting there. As far as he's the runs, who has a better? Who, who would you put second? As far as like, it's not run, over yet. We're, we're, let's wait till it's painted. Let's wait till it's, it's not even over yet. Let's wait till it's painted for for okay. we, we we put it. Well, somewhere. I'm just saying, but, but like, it's definitely special. Like the, wait until it's the number one guy. Because oh, wait till he number falls, one guy and for then you'll do it in a row. Let's wait for the negative shit to happen before we come. Wait for him to do that. Tay Tay Rock. T Rock has the most Rock had a good Rock had Rock's a good run, run is special too because Rock run. Rock has the most consecutive Summer Madness appearances. That means every single year for six years in a row, you saw Rock on Summer Madness. Him and Clips are tied for gnome, they're five apiece, five years in With, a row. So that Rock has more than Cal? Yeah. Yeah. Hell yeah. Cal how many? Three or four? What summer madness? Yeah, I thought Rex so, was the highest summer madness. He did the first five. He did the first five consecutively. One, yeah. two, three, four, five. Okay. okay. But but check this out. Look how. Yo, good. do you understand that the shit he's saying? I have to look it up. <laughs> and not only do I have to look it up, then I have to read it verbatim from what I fucking look up. Yeah. Yeah. This guy is just pulling yeah. this out of his fucking head. Yeah. I do this shit all we do this shit yeah. all the time. Holy oh, shit. I mean, yeah. These are the people that talk about battle rap, so shout out to Hollow the Don, he has the greatest flex. Hollow the Don's the only battle to ever headline a gnome, Summer Madness in the volume. And has, head, has, has, has headlined every single battle yeah. he's had in his career for a decade. Mm -hmm. That is such a flex, bro. You said Summer Madness, um, Lux no, too, right? what else? Yeah, Lux, Lux. too. Yeah. And you said a value? Actually, the one time Lux and Mook did a headline against Hollow and Joe Buttons. I don't know if you guys want to count that or oh, not. But, but look at that. When they, so you said irony, headline, they go against each other value? and they don't headline. What was he saying? You said wow. Summer Madness. He's 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 and by the way, no, 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 no headline any other time. He said three. Wow. No, that. Summer Madness and Val Valley. Oh, right. right so it was Arsenal. Yeah. It was um. Look at Rob. Arsenal's never headlined in Summer Madness. No, but he still he had on uh, Valley Mix. It's all my head. Oh, man. Oh, man. Yeah, man. Hollow. Um. Hollow's the only one that has all three. Hollow's the only one with all three. I'm trying to name all three. I'm trying to name all three without you telling me. Right. It was uh Arsenal in the volume. It was uh. No, pick a match. Summer Madness, pick a match. Yeah, pretty much. See, see Ben trying to try Hollow was the first. I see him. I see him. He, <laughs> Hollow was the first. He just ain't gonna let Fred try it by himself. Hollow was the first. He's trying like to get his shit off. But yeah. now there we go. I got it. I got it. I got it. Right. It was Goods. It was um. Yeah, fuck that. It was Goods, Arsenal, <laughs> and fucking uh, mm -hmm. and some of Madness shit. The other was, guy. Uh, hit me and Holla. The other guy. Hit me and Holla. Hit me Holla. So, so dominant. I asked this question shit. because. Again, man, you know, CPR is like, it's, it's very dangerous to the battle rappers. Oh, yeah. But I don't want people to think like that's all you do. No. Nah. You yeah. know. It's probably so, less than 10% of what we do. Right, right. And that's, what I, that's why I just want to make that clear. You know, and then the way these guys was coming at you, I thought they were totally against it, too. So, nah, you know. I love friends. I like Reaper no. Rowe. Reaper Rowe asked for his after he choked. He said, yo, tell me my numbers. Tell me my numbers. Oh, okay. Tell me my numbers. What's my numbers? I was like, I got you. Well, because people should care about that stuff. But there is, there are people who... I'm surprised the leagues don't already count how many times you somebody know? is like, yo, this is your fifth time or sixth time. Or Technically, they should, right? Because they should know the stats of the person they're about to spend money on. Would so, you want, do you, would you take one all-time classic round from Loaded Lux. Just one. And he chokes in the other two. 
over say it happened already. Eighty percent of the other battle rappers, uh, you fans are gonna take what Lux does in that mm. one great round. I think, I think three rounds of whoever else. But you know what? Too you gotta you gotta take into account of like you crazy for that. You, you gotta take you gotta take into account the sample size. Like right now, Ace Amin has four out of nine chokes, but he has nine battles. Like if he has five more battles, that ratio changes drastically. Okay. You know what I mean? Right. 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 But I and know. it matters. A ratio should matter because. Four out of five is bad. Mm -hmm. That's fucking. That's forty-four percent, man. That's, that's bad. But but you know what? But the only way though it starts to matter is if that you use those or fans use those stats to be like, okay, this person who's not choking, this person who is doing well, should get looked. I never see that like reciprocity on the other side. It no, never it's happens. battle rap, man. What reciprocity? It, it never happens. Fuck right, you want to but, exist. But there has to be something there. If that matters, then it has the pendulum. Right. Pendulum has You're to swing right. the other way. You there has right. to be balance here. You are right. So if you're gonna say that choke percentage is high or whatever, then why not give a guy who has been doing well a shot? Fans, why are you not advocating for guys who do well? Uncle Rob, you know what's crazy, bro? That is Ca the question. Caffeine, as a, as a as a era, as a company, as a as a, as its own entity, CPR is a hundred percent. They have not missed a beat. Every single event, all 12, 13 weeks, has had a choke in it. Mm. Over eighteen artists have choked. In the cafe and everything. Every event. Every event. But what's funny not is one event with no chokes. There's not one without no chokes. But what's crazy is if you combine all three band legacies, that's probably more than 18 chokes. Maybe I could be wrong. But there's a lot of chokes in that. But it feels spread out as opposed to seeing it weekly. You're like, damn, it's, who's gonna be the next person this time? Who's gonna be the next person this time? You know what I'm saying? It's almost you can guarantee one at this point. You you know, you know uh, that part of the movie of Batman when the Joker says. Where does he get all these toys? <laughs> hey, you know that part? That's how I'm sitting there thinking about how the fuck does he know all of this shit? <laughs> <laughs> Holy <laughs> fuck! That's too much. But uh, again, man, so um, yeah. I appreciate that you actually do that, man. That's, I think that's needed. And shout out to uh, Verse Tracker. It's like certain things in battle rap that we need, you know, because we get the reference shit. Yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah. Like, and, uh, yeah, quick, Ryan, Ryan update that shit, bro. You slacking. It's, oh, that's, the oh, guy that, that's the guy 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 that's Accepted battle rap jargon like that's and if it doesn't happen, people are like people you know, what the fuck? will revolt. They accuse this man of all type of things. <laughs> <laughs> he was in the plot of money heist, Uncle Ra. Yeah, I was in Atlantic oh. City with that 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 yeah. money from Champion. Yeah, yeah they said it. it up. Yeah, they got all type of conspiracy theories. So I'm just saying. <laughs> so when people do things like this, like you know, it's your breaking ground, right? Yeah. So what that means is that in five years, people will need to know what the CPR is. You. <laughs> You got to still do that shit. Yeah, yeah, I'm just that's saying, that's this, that's when it becomes ingrained in the culture, you, you know, we, we, we don't utilize the URL app enough because yeah. although there's yeah. a leaderboard there and everybody's like, hey, I don't trust those, yeah. those are paying Patreons that are making these statistics on the app. Whether you want to call it bias or not, yeah. but like at one point, the highest voted winner on that app was Swamp and t and against Twerk. Yeah. And that means Swamp had the biggest victory on the app. Then it was Jerry West all those versus battles. Louisi. I need one. Very yeah, first it was Jerry West and Louisi. Then it's now Swamp and Twerk. One very simple update to the app is necessary. Yeah. Did Talk so about and so it. win? Did so and so lose? And that's it. They have that. And and they have that already. It's a little different though. But it's not. People don't know. They don't people don't know to work. They, they it has it. to be because they're. It's stats. not that. There's a, there's a leaderboard, them. bro. Let me but tell you something. But off the reaction. Hey. I'll give you a funny stat. I don't think you can. You really count the reactions? No, 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 no. I don't even let use me, that. Let me, let me break it down to you. I'll, 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 I'll show you in the app. I'll even show you in the app. I'm opening for you I right now. I think they they fixed that. They have. It, they I think have in a the vote. beginning. They have a You vote. were able to do like the reactions of the motherfuckers but by you, yourself. But then how do you count the previous battles that were based? Like I don't know. That's weird to me. I I don't know. Voting is what it is. Consensus is okay, what it quick. is. You see Mike P and Bill collecting, sure, right? Sure. See that blue number fifty four yeah, 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 and that sure. red number forty nine? Yeah, yeah. That's not reactions. Yeah, yeah. When you click the battle, that's at the bottom, right? right? At the bottom of the battle, you're gonna see Mike P's name and Bill collector's name. You yeah. can tap that, that's and it fun. circles, and that's your register vote. And when you go to your profile, my life, when you go to when you go to your profile, I'm just trying to show you right sure. here. When you go to your profile, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. you go to my scorecards. Mm -hmm. You can see who you pick as winners. Yeah, you can see. You, got you can see your winners. But but the your winners. But do you see? 
It's all put together, though. Oh, okay. all the, so, all for the example, people like, we all know Geechee Gotti and Rum Nitty yeah. are fucking Jordan and Scotty Pippen on this mm -hmm. app. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? The leaderboard has Rum Nitty at 13-1 and one and has Geechee at 11-3. Mm -hmm. In real life, you can argue they're not really at that record, but the okay. app has them there. So that means, look how dominant they are on the app. Yeah, but, how people, but how many people are going to go but back? Here, here's, was, to, here's what's crazy. Yeah. Geechee's last two losses came back to back, and mm -hmm. it was Chilla and Averb. So he lost to those battles on the app where he's beloved. So I made a stat, I made a stat, yeah, whatever, but I made a stat, and I was like, I was like, for the first time in the, in the yeah, app whatever. history, Geechee Gotti lost back-to-back -back votes on the app. Sure. And he saw, and it, I mean, it's true, he lost back-to-back -back on the app, and he goes, man, it's some Mark-ass Buster shit, man, what, what, what kind of shit is this? And I'm like, yo, Geechee, man, take it easy, that's what the people say, it's not what I'm saying. It's the stats, like, I'm not making this up. Yeah, you, you can go on the app yourself and see that's how they feel. So when, when the app says Rummer Geechee lost, they lost. Because <laughs> they're dominant on it. Wow. If Tony Bro says they lost, I mean, then they, they lost. They probably won. They probably won. This word <laughs> After a couple watches. I know you don't you like know, them, I, Those are the best comments. Yeah, I watched I, it a couple times. I because. want to um, thank you guys very, 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 very much for even taking the time out to do this with me. I know you guys have your own channels, man. And... This this conversations we've been having all day, man, has been just fucking incredible, man. Um, I have a different crowd of respect for you, I each you. of you. Um, I know you guys. You know we we we've, we've, we've seen each other on countless of times at, at, at events and shit like that. And um, like I think this the this this makes you guys like part of my family. Man. Family. You gotta say you know it. Like I got a little bit of different insight in you guys, and you know, well, Tone's top tier, so. Oh, that, oh, okay, all right. right. Yeah, all they have right. done Illuminati shit together. So. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, Illuminati. Yeah, top yeah, team, like top team media. Um, but uh, yeah, just knows everything. I'm fucking nobody. Like I'm oh, just the guy. person on the this side. Now you yeah. Mr. Pack just pack them up, bro. Talk, right. talk shit all the time. I'm, I'm, I'm just a nerd. I'm just a bad rap nerd. <laughs> <laughs> but I really appreciate you guys, and I appreciate your contribution to the culture too. So we appreciate you, Like giving us this opportunity. A lot of people, they watch this shit, but like. To be up here is a big opportunity. It's a lot of love. It's a lot of um, opportunity that's not to be taken lightly. You know what I mean? Because at the end of the day, we love this culture. You know what I mean? You love this culture. We love this culture. The people that's watching love it, so we thank you as well. You know what I mean? And we all make choices and decisions that we do or release content and shit like that that is not always, you know, your mother would approve. You know, but we, 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 we yeah. do what we do, and I know all of you guys love the culture like I do, so that's what's important to me. That's too, a factory. So. Yeah. Yeah. So. Still the uh, 50 minutes of fame, man. Ben Crazy. Ah. Shout out Selfs out and everybody on your, your, yeah, your team man. and all the of that. Team, man. Um, ben Swayze, New Ever Podcast. Make sure you subscribe to the channel, man. We are the funniest podcast. On yeah, the yeah, fucking yeah. list right now, man. Shout out to everybody else to do anything, but we entertaining. We love them. Tell us a damn I'm wild. Um, Lil Freddy, Dutch KIB, Lola, everybody on the team. I love y'all. You already know. Subscribe, whoever podcast. Friends, let's talk battle rap podcast. Shout out to the team, man. Shout out to Vlad, CC, Tim, Dylan, Titus. I love all y'all, man. I wouldn't be able to make this ship run without y'all. Black Compass Media, shout out to the whole society, man. Uh, everybody that, from coast to coast that rock with us, man. From uh, my man Pose, shout out to Kohler, shout out to Driz, shout out to Polo. We out here, man, whole society. So between all of that, too, man, everybody here I think is very talented. Uh, on top of that, man, definitely subscribe to these brothers. Like, we all have our own way of doing things. If you like this interview, our different styles. Rock with the media, you know what I mean? You're not going to always agree with everything we say. That's not really what it's designed to do. And I want to shout out to Uncle Rob for being an evangelist in this. Because that's really what it is about evangelism. The more people that watch this or watch a battle, they go back. Even if you want to yell at me for paragraphs, I got essays <laughs> from people killing me. They just, they broke down the battle, they insulted me, and I left like, well... You know, only thing I read in that paragraph is that you watched the battle five times, and I'm cool with that. You know what I mean? So, right. subscribe, man. Shout out to the coaches. Contribute to the culture when the world opens up. Come to the battles. Let's let's be outside. You know what I mean? When this when this thing gets back to where it needs to right. be. But shout out to the whole team. You know what I mean, Tone Bro. Thanks, guys.
15 minutes of fame, ladies. Let's go!